Fellow citizens, wherever you are, I don't know what you're doing right now. I've, I've just, uh, just heard and found out that Robert Gabriel Mugabe has resigned. I'm just waiting for the confirmation to come through. But, uh, I, can't, I, just, I can't believe what I'm hearing. Um, if what I'm hearing is true, I'm just waiting for confirmation, but I'm hearing that, uh, I'm hearing that it's over. Um, you don't know how I feel right now. I'm... This is just incredible. Robert Mugabe has resigned. <laughs> I didn't, no one thought this was gonna be possible. Finally, we've done it. Fellow Zimbabweans, it's over. It's finished. <sighs> Robert Mugabe has resigned. Oh my gosh. Um, oh my goodness. Guys, I'm at loss of words. I don't know what to say. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's over. It's finally over. It's all over now. We thought we would never ever get rid of him. But the work has paid off. We did it. We pressured him, we pressured him, we pressured him, and we pressured him. And he resigned. Every single day that we were in prison, every day we were arrested and beaten. I thank God that it's paid off. Now we've got to build this country into something that we have never, that no one ever thought that they could see. But for now, bye bye, Robert Mugabe. Made me cry long enough. We're going to go and celebrate now. Wherever you are, uh, Zimbabwe has just changed. Something incredible has just happened here. It's done, it's done. Yes. I'm going to go live on to a TV broadcast right now. I'm on an interview in SABC, so we'll talk a bit later, fellow citizens. But what a day. What a day. What a result. These are historic scenes that you're witnessing right now. A change of thought in Zimbabwe and a country that has never heard of Mugabe as a new era will begin in the country.
Amen. 